tomorrow. Um, hit the gym with Justin. And uh, I got a good idea for a TikTok, so a good outfit idea. Try that out. I'm gonna pop this roof off while we chill in here. You look absolutely adorable. Oh, thanks, guys. How's everybody doing today on this beautiful Monday? It's the start of the week. Hope everyone's ready to grind and have fun, you know? Most importantly, have fun. But not too much fun, you know? You gotta grind. <clears throat> Ooh, the shades look sick. Thank you, Kate. Um, dude, you look fire today. What do you guys think? Shades or no shades? Shades? I mean, no shades? Shades. Longboarding, I know it's a perfect, perfect day to longboard. Did you see Calvin Klein's Twitter? I did. I saw that. It's pretty cool. What the frick? Friggin' a little whitey came in the car. Another little whitey, where are they coming from? Jesus, Murphy. That's not my car. Yo guys, you think for the vibe today, you think it's a no bracelet vibe? Or you think it's a bracelet vibe? Maybe because we're longboarding, nice Jamaican bracelet. You know, the long hair don't care. Are you proud of your girls? Yes, I am. Very proud and very thankful. And yeah everything so know that guys love you guys let's just uh keep being positive and keep finding new ways to be happy and find new things to just to make things exciting you know and uh yeah that's it it's been a wicked year i just want to keep making the years more and more wicked. But again, can't thank you guys enough for friggin' changing my life, you know? And uh, we don't got the full 5K in here, but um, we got 1.3, which I don't even care if it went down to 200 anymore. I'm at the point where I did care so much about fame at the point where I don't care too much about fame anymore. It's more just like, I just wanna be happy and have like a good support system. So, yeah, so as you noticed, I don't know if you guys have, I've been more trying to do my own thing, like on live, trying to just, you know, but I'm also trying to read the comments too and stay interactive, but trying to have that balance and not just totally just be all in. I don't know, maybe I'm going too deep, but trying to really uh, figure out what Will wants and to see his, see his true fans because I know I got a lot of true fans. So, um, you know, and uh, yeah. But um, for everyone that's here, true fan or not, thank you for being here. Um, especially for my true fans though, guys, thank you so much for believing in me, being here for me. And um, yeah, thank you. I'm, uh, you know, I'm, my life's changed this year. I think I'm much happier this year. I think I'm a lot more stressed. Um, but I'm happier. So, and uh, I'm just gonna continue to be happy. A lot of, biggest thing that happened this year, I think, was just learning lessons more than anything, more than signing with IMG, more than making a ton of money, more than becoming famous, more than all that, just learning. I learned a lot this year. I learned what I want, what I don't want. I learned who I want in my life and who I don't want in my life. I learned a lot of things like that. Um, and I feel like an old man already, 
even though I'm only 22. I also feel like a kid at the same time, so it's pretty weird. I don't know, but um, it's been awesome. And uh, again, thank you guys for believing in me, you know? Um, yeah. Kristen, thank you, thank you. So yeah, thanks guys, it's been great. Um, and yeah. It's just, now the next question is what's next, you know? I was, uh, and I'll always do 80s, because sometimes I worry, I'm like, okay, wait, if I don't do 80s anymore, my fans won't like me. My true fans know that, I mean, my true fans don't care, like, doing 80s or not. But, like, that is my niche, so I'm going to keep doing, like, those old music. But um, I'm going to also switch in to the newer music and stuff, as you guys seen. I've been doing that. Um, yeah. So there will be a lot of, like, <clears throat> there will be a lot of changes. Um, just want you guys to know that. Like, it won't be just all... And, uh, you know, it's not me being like, yo, F you guys, I'm now a rapper. <laughs> you know, it's not like that. It's like, yo, come with me. I'm going to rap for a bit. You're going to support me. And, uh, and yeah, I don't know. It's just, I just, yeah, that's all. <clears throat> Thanks, guys. Yeah, because, like, I'm not, like, fully committed to one thing, you know? I'm kind of, like, a worldwide guy, I think. I like to do it all. And I think you guys know that, though. You guys, like, just love me for who I am, you know? We can just do random stuff, answer questions, talk about random stuff, and, uh, yeah, it, uh, I'm starting to realize it doesn't really matter like where I am or what I end up being. I always got my true fans with me and that's a blessing. So it's pretty awesome. Just so you know, everyone out there, you all have true fans. Everyone's got true fans out there. Um, yeah. Just cause you're not famous doesn't mean you don't have fans. What I was trying to say because uh, I'm a fan of a lot of people who aren't famous. It's like, yo, I want that guy's life, yo. What's your favorite song? My mouth's getting dry, I need water. I'm gonna go inside real quick. Favorite song? <sighs> right now? Honestly? It's this rap song and it's like, but it's pretty like the swearing in it, it's pretty like wicked. But it's, um, it's this YouTuber and he like never um, rapped before in his life. So like this rapper that's famous is like, yo, like rap. So he's like, this is my first time rapping it. But the way he like rapped was so good. I was like, yo. I literally think it'd be so cool if you just like, just randomly like rap and you just like kill it. Okay, what was I gonna do in here? You guys remember? I gotta shave this beard though. This freaking patchy freaking thing. What was I gonna do in here though? I feel like I came in water. Thanks guys. My mouth is dry and coffee is not helping.
This is my first time wrapping it. Cotton mouth, literally. <laughs> When are you going to, no, I don't know if I'm going to, I don't know where it is, somewhere there. Um, I don't know when either, if it's this or next, but there's an, something coming up soon, which I'm excited for, but you guys will find out about it, so don't worry. Your hair is always on point. How are you, Will? I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. I'm okay. <laughs> Actually, now that you say it, Shit! Life sucks. Like, what do you mean? No, I'm okay. I'm okay. Thanks. Right. Song name Avalanche. Think. Okay, wait. I'll try to play it for you guys quick. There's just just a warning. A lot of people might not like it. It's pretty wicked. Because this rapper is definitely not PG-13. I know you guys aren't either, but he um he's pretty wicked. And he's only 18. This is my first time rapping it. It's freaking chilly in my house. Okay, so I got acting at two o'clock. My buddy's coming over right now. And then act for a bit. And then after acting, go to the gym. And then chill. All right, so we're gonna put on, I think it's called this. How do you spell avalanche? Is it A V A L? Avalanche. Avalanche. I think this is what it's called. I think so. I think so. Bust down roll the average. Go back to the average. Yeah, this is it. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. It's good, it gets me pumped. Saying don't you doubt the kid, saying don't you doubt the kid. It's so good. This is my first time rapping it. I'm like go retarded shit. Yeah, that's his first time rapping. Isn't that sick? He's like, it's my first time rapping it. I'm like go retarded shit. Bentley Coop, I'm dashing it. Standing with my money in my tall. So good. Okay, one second, I gotta send the
Okay, one sec, I gotta send the... Okay, one sec, I gotta send the ad... Out the kid. <clears throat> oh. All right, so we got water. Then we'll head back to the car. I was thinking about it today. I was like, thank you, Sharon. I was thinking about it today, and I was like, yo, literally. If the lightning questions were better, we could have so much fun because we could actually like have like discussion topics and talk about things like that. But the lightning questions suck. Sorry, TikTok, don't ban me, but you suck. Fix your lightning questions, man. Like, we're trying to have fun. A lot of breath and have anxiety from rapping. See, rapping gives me anxiety. It's like too much cockiness, you know? It's like, don't you doubt the kid. Yeah, I'm all, whoa, whoa. You know? And then you're like, holy crap. I don't want to be that guy. <laughs> Just trying to be a nice guy. All right. Let's see what we got today. We're going to pick one lucky thing out of the box. Here we go. Don't you doubt the kid. Let's see. It says, happiness is not always doing what you want, but always wanting to do what you do. I'll read that again for the people in the back. Happiness is not always doing what you want, but always wanting to do what you do. That's hard. I don't know what the fuck he's All I heard was happiness is not what you want, but it's what you want. That's all I heard. Oh, I kind of get it. Yeah, I get it. Like, it's not like, like don't, like it's not like to do what you want. It's like to do what you want. You know what I mean? It's not to do what you want, it's to do what you want. That's the best I can explain. Bust down all my Amy! Amy, you are so generous. Just comes in, shoots a line right in the morning. Thanks, Amy. 
Did you see homies roar friggin' a couple days ago? I knew you guys would like that. What's that more like? Ah, uh, dude. This is my first time rapping it. I might go retard shit. Can you imagine? They're like, all right, guys, we got a special guest on stage today. He's going to try rapping for the first time. Here he comes. Whitey. Everyone's like, who? And I'm like, this is my first time rapping it. They're like, oh. Everyone starts standing up. I might go retard shit. Bentley Coop, I dash the whip. Oh. Oh, oh, and I'm like, yeah, it's a fantasy. Yeah, it's a fantasy. It's a fantasy. <laughs> hello, Robin. Hello, hello. Top eight, what the heck? Where did this come from? Oh, I think we were up there. Hey, right. you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna pick. What's down on the average? No lady bro. Okay, you know what? What we're gonna really try to do right now is fix this question box. Um, but I forget how to do it. Like guys, we've been trying to do this for like so long and it's just not working. Alright. What is this? What is that? Remove gas request. I'm having a heart attack. I can't breathe. Did you see Calvin Klein? I did. You guys are the best. I just, uh, yeah. It's a pole. What is it for though? Any more modeling jobs, man, like honestly, I did so good this year and then I just blew it and not one modeling agency wants me anymore. So no, nah, I'll probably never model my life again. It just sucks. Yo, what's this pole, dude? Remove multi guest. I'm only 18 little... I'm kidding, are you nuts? Even if you hit me in the face with a hammer, even if you shaved my head bald, even if you cut my wingy wing off, I would still be a model. It's the heart that matters, guys. It's the heart. I'd be the first, like... What is up with this guy? Why is he sexy? My first time rapping, I might like, go retard. <sighs> it's my first time rapping it. I might like, go retard. You're not just a model, you're right, I'm a rapper. I'm a rapper. I'm marking it right now. All right. Diet Coke just sent you a line. Diet Coke. He was joking. I'm going to start joking all the time. 
because then people don't even know what's real or what's not, you know? Just trick you guys and just watch everyone just be like, yo, what, what, what? No, I'm kidding. I would never do that. But, yeah, I'm going to make some jokes. I think it's just funny, you know? <clears throat> Your acting can come across real sometimes. Trust me. Trust me. It's because I'm such a good liar. I'm the best liar. Jokes! This is my first time rapping it. I'm not over. P.O. Box today. I should go. But they haven't called me. Usually I wait for them to call me because then it's like really like, you know, and then, yeah. Will, why are you so mean, bro? Yo, guys, people are sending roses right now. Thank you so much. Lori's going nuts. We're almost at 700 roses. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. The birds chirping, they're always chirping. No, I just said I was mean because a girl told me to shave and I blocked her. That was me being a little like bit of a dick there because I kind of want people to tell me like shave, you know, if I like, or if I look bad, like tell me. But I was just, I don't know, insecure. I'm like, get out. But I'll let her back. She can make another account. She had no followers. Fake account. Just make another account. You know? <laughs> you guys and your fake friggin' accounts, I tell ya. <clears throat> Stop when you don't freak out. Lightning question. What happens after the self tape? So after the self tape, um, hopefully people like it and then it catches on and then I catch a movie or something. Um, well, actually after the self tape, so we send the self tape to WME, which is my acting agency. And then they do send it to like movie roles and stuff. And then they'll contact me and let me know if like what movie roles I got and stuff. So I don't know how quick it's going to be. Like it might be like right away. It might never happen. I don't freaking know, but we'll see how the self tape goes. I got acting today, which is like, I think we got like two or three more classes until the self tape. It's going to be lit though. It's going to be lit. I'm excited. This week, I'm really just gonna practice on moving my body. Have you not done your self tape? No, listen, you're blocked, you're gone, see you later. But listen, the reason why, it's cause it took a year. I took forever, I was new to acting. Um, I missed a lot of acting classes. I was, it was new to it. I didn't, you know, it was, I was all over the place, so. It's taken a year. 
I know it's been crazy. I've been getting a lot of hate for it, especially from my agency. They're like, yo, what the heck? It's been a year. Um, but, but yeah, like, it is what it is. Even if it takes me three years, fuck off. I can take fucking six years. You know what I'm saying? It takes freaking eight years if I want to, guys. It take as long as I want. But, anyway, hopefully this year blows up, you know what I'm saying? Top four, like what? That came out of nowhere. Is it the start of the week? Yeah, it is. No, because people just know what to, like, say on me, eh? Like, your acting tape's still not out. What the heck? Did, did, did I stutter? Yes, it's still not out. Do you want me to repeat it? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um, like, fuck. Way to pull on the heartstrings. Took me a year. I get it. I get it. Like, I get it, okay? I'm a friggin' pot-smoking bum that just... Yeah. No. I'm a classy, sexy mother effer. Same question. You think your acting tape done? Do you have any modeling jobs? Modeling? Where's modeling? You know what, mother... I'll freaking work construction if I want. Freaking dig holes all day if I want. And I'll still have fans. So... So leave me alone, bro. Sorry, guys. I'm just venting. But, like, Will needs to vent, bro. You know how good it feels to vent right now? I'm starting to feel like a real person. I can actually stick up for myself. You know what I'm saying? You gotta talk. You gotta, you gotta be you. Who cares? You know? I know who I am. I know who I am! Actually, not really. Frig. What has been your most embarrassing moment? Most embarrassing moment ever? Honestly, one of the most embarrassing moments was saying my phone number on live. After all, like, everything going on, you know, haters, people stalking me, which, whatever, but everything going on, I was very, uh, very nervous. I think a couple fans see me right now, um, but I was nervous. And I said my number on live and freaking got out everywhere. I was like, oh my gosh, it's the most embarrassing thing. So I was also very confident that live. I was feeling so good. And I'm talking to Justin. I'm drinking. I think Justin was there. I'm drinking. And then I go, oh yeah, my phone number, 289, blah, 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 blah. And then you guys are like, Will, what the heck? And I'm like, yeah. It was with Adam. Of course. Thanks, Adam. No, I'm kidding. But yeah, Frig. That was that was the dumbest. That was probably the most embarrassing moment of my life. Um, trying to think of another embarrassing moment. my phone gonna die one sec all right we're at 11 percent a warning for all 1.6 people in here if it dies and i don't say goodbye the word of the day today is enjoy no fun fun we're gonna have fun today no matter what we're going to the gym i don't want to go to the gym you know why i don't want to go to the gym because it's been like two days since i've been in the gym and i'm dreading it because i'm just dreading it especially going with justin you know justin's so annoying you guys know right Go with Justin, have to hear him talk the whole time, and then go to the gym. I'm dreading it, but you know what? I'm gonna have fun today at the gym. I'm gonna go to the gym today and have fun. I'm gonna have fun. I'm gonna make it fun, I'm gonna listen to music, I'm gonna dance on the treadmill. I'm not just gonna look at it as like a grind. I'm gonna say, yo, I get to go to sauna. I'll pay in $100 a month for this membership. 
use it to frig up and have fun, you know? So that's the word of the day. Amy with the universe. All right, I think we just got to number, we're number four, let's go. Thank you guys. Amy, thank you so much. Villa, thank you for the glasses and for the roses, guys. Thank you guys so much. Again, you guys don't have to do that, but if you want to, I ain't gonna say no. <laughs> I, can, I was just gonna stand up and scream there, but. <laughs> Top three. You're gonna twerk. I was literally gonna, I was literally gonna be like, you guys wanna send it? I ain't gonna say it, no. And I was gonna start twerking my butt. And then I thought about it and I was like, it's gonna be all over the internet though. And then I'm like, do I want that all over the internet? Last summer, this summer, that's another embarrassing moment. I shouldn't even be saying it cause now you guys are gonna repost it, especially my haters. But me just dingling my dingling in those onesies and stuff, dancing, it's pretty embarrassed. Because you guys just got me all hot and heavy, you know? Like, we were just having a good time on live, laughing, having fun. And I just, you know me, I just, I go a little too far sometimes. You know what I'm saying? But it's whatever. It's the past. It was fun. We had some fun. But, yeah, when I see those, I'm like, on the internet, I'm like, I'm like, there's me thinking I'm all cute, dancing, friggin' basically being a stripper. Not actually, but you know what I mean? <laughs> no, it's just, it was funny. We're just having fun. It's like, it's like sexy, funny. Like it's all just like one and one. It's like, it's fun entertainment. Um, yeah, that's how I look at it. Dude, I'm catching these freaking haters like no tomorrow. Kristen B just said boring. Awesome since 1979. Well, guess what, Kristen? You were awesome. 1979. Well, we're in 2022. You are not awesome. You are. You out of here. Get out of here. Call me boring. I'm going to fight back. And I won't be mean. But I'm going to fight back. We're going to we're going to play fight. All right. I like to play fight. Yeah, no, she was freaking awesome in 1979. I don't know what the... No, nah, I'm being so mean. But no one knows who she is. It's not a big deal. She gone. Listen, keep your comments to yourself. If, if, you're in, if you're 45 or however old you are, and you come in a 22 year old's live and you call him boring, you need a life. So move on. I'm just trying to think like if I really hated a 22 year old kid, I don't think I'd even call him boring. I think I would just like be like, I don't even know what I'd do. I'd just leave him alone probably. But it's just like, you know what I mean? It's just embarrassing. It's embarrassing, bro. If someone takes your phone and finds out that you're on someone's a 22 year old's page saying bad things. And I'll tell you one thing, IMG, all these people have six security teams. I have friends asking me, yo, do you want me to find out who this person is? Cause I can find out like that. And this, and I say no, cause I'm not paying if I don't want to find out who the hater is. But just so you know, this is just, just a warning. There's people in this new generation, just so you know, cause you guys are older, so you don't know. A lot of you don't know. This new generation, there are people that are the best hackers in the world, my age, that hack into everything. They can find out just like that, your IP address, where you are, everything. And I don't want to get into that stuff. I just know there's people that can do that. So for your own sake, do not comment hate under people's things. Because if you get caught commenting hate under a 22-year-old kid's thing, or anyone, you get caught putting hate, you look so dumb. Unless you're actually like have a real reason and you're trying to like figure something out and help out or something. But if you're just like giving it, like, yo... That's not good. Like you're going to get caught. And even if you don't get caught, you have to live with that. 
You gotta live with that. And it's okay, you can change right now. Change today. Pretend, pretend Will's voice right now, me talking, was literally you changing your life. And then you change from here. Take a screenshot of this live and say, I changed from this day and everyone will forgive you. But you need to change right the fuck now. Because if you keep doing this stuff, you're just killing yourself and you're hurting us too. You know, we don't want to see that stuff. Anyway, I'm not going to get too deep. I ain't a preacher, but maybe I am. But, but yeah, that's all. Just be careful. That's all I'm saying. Be careful with what you put on the internet. Be careful with all that stuff. People are watching you. People know how to find who you are. And it's just like, that's sketchy. So be careful. And I'm doing this out of the goodness of my heart. Like, I would not want, like, just say, like, you're a mom. Comment. I would not want my mom to get caught commenting under a 22-year-old kid's thing, hate. I would be so disappointed in my mom. Like, I would be, like, embarrassed. You know what I mean? So it's like, I'm just trying to help. Don't get caught in that stuff. You're going to get, if you get caught, it's going to be the most embarrassing thing ever. And I won't be the one to rat you out and tell everyone because I'm not that guy. I'm not. I don't want to hurt anyone because I'm like happy in my own life. But, well, I'm trying to be. Naturally, I'm a pretty happy guy. But it's like, but yeah, just be careful. All right, guys, be careful. Um, that's all. We're number one. Let's go. Let's go. No, yeah, like, guys, I don't need, like, praises at all. I'm not trying to, like, you know... Um, I'm not trying to hate on anyone. I'm trying to like end it. Like, let's just be happy. But I'm just like letting people know that it is actually dangerous to even make fake accounts and do that stuff because you can easily get caught nowadays. My friends are doing it. People are doing it left, right, and center. And they do it like for fun. And they it's literally just like, I don't do it. I think it's like, I don't want to like even do that stuff. But I just, I'm doing it on your own safety, guys. Just be freaking careful because you can make a mistake like that so easy and you look so dumb. You look so dumb, you know? And then it's like, Frank, you just got caught, yo. So, that's all I'm saying, but I love you guys. Nanny, you out of here. Have a good, uh, have a good day. Um, and yeah, that's about it. But let's change the subject, because we were going off there. I'm, I wasn't trying to get heated, but I'm not heated, but you know? Bouncing off the walls now, Frig. Conversation got a little hectic. Thanks, guys. No, it's true. And I'm not saying, and listen, I'm not saying I haven't done hate. I've, I've given hate. And I remember the exact time I made a fake account and I was pissed because someone was getting chirped and I made the decision one day to chirp other people on a fake account. I felt like shit. This was like two years ago for like, I still feel bad about it to this day. I'm always thinking, can you imagine someone found out that that was me hating on someone? Like, could you imagine how big of a loser you look sitting on your couch, like, hating? So, like, I'm just letting you guys know, like, it's an easy mistake humans make, but just don't do it anymore. Enough. Enough. We're, we're canceling it. All right? No more. Um. Anyway, it's 11 o'clock. The phone is about to die pretty soon. My buddy's coming over right now. I think he's going to make me a nice brunch. I'm going to give Kelly a call, see what he's up to this morning. And uh, I think we're good for today, guys.
because my face is getting tired. That's when I know it's time to end the live. My face starts getting tired. I feel like I need to stretch or something. So I think it's time to just wrap it up right now. But I also don't want to end it off this note because we were just having like a calm live and then it kind of went to that. But just so you guys know, haters, fans, everyone, mostly fans because fuck the haters, but just want you guys to know that I'm not getting mad about this. I am getting mad about this, but I'm just, just speaking my thought. It's just, you know, but that's all. Need to be said. Thank you guys so much though. Have a great rest of your day. The word of the day is fun. No matter what we do, even if you're at work, have fun. All right. Um, and, uh, all right guys, I'm going to go chill for a bit. Maybe watch a movie before my acting and then wait for my buddy. And then I got to go to the freaking gym, which I'm dreading, but I'm going to have fun with it. So that's it. All right, guys. Love you so freaking much. Have a great rest of your day. Love you. Also, thanks for giving me a top one. Guys, that was amazing. Thank you.